Hello everybody, it's Zero Wolf, and I'm back again for another Let's Play Triangle Strategy. Uh, so we're, a lot of the first two parts have been basically like setting down the groundwork and everything for the actual game. So we haven't exactly uh, done much of anything for the game, really, per se. Um, so that will change this time around, <laughs> I hope. So, uh, yeah. So, um... Well, we'll see what happens for uh, this dealio. Um, so if we get more action. So basically we're at the point where it's like, uh, it's my nation's birthday. It's, I have a wife to marry and kill and have a gold of the frame for it. I'm swamped. And we're pretty much at that stage for this game. Like we have uh, the party for the uh, event of Cremain the Mind. We also have the wedding. I'm also taking over my dad's seat. So yeah, it's it's a bit of a it's, a, it's quite a bit on our plate here. <sighs> but like I said, I love these kind of games. Um, these are my probably my favorites to play. So, uh, yeah. The camera is still not quite right. I'm missing that right edge blur. That's weird. Yeah. So we'll see what we can uh, get into today. Um, so yeah. We did the extra scene uh, last episode, so now we're going into the actual uh, event. Now that's what I call a feast. What the party is the hotel lobby in? You've landed quite the catch, Frederica. He is a good man. I can see it in his eyes. He is drunk. You are too kind, Lord Tregan. And humble as well. Are you impressed as I, Frederica? I can tell that your heart is pure and gentle, my lord. Lady Frederica. Forgive me if I caused offense. I thought only to return your sincerity and kind. Girl, you need no apologies are needed. I am happy to meet your approval. I thank you, my lord. <laughs> Words come so easily to the both of you, and a perfect match. Forgive my curiosity. What sort of life did Lady Frederica lead in Esfrost? Bro, why are you asking in front of the herd, man? Her life? <laughs> Truth be told, my dear, Sir Noah, not a pleasant one. Those of Rosellen blood are looked down upon in Esfrost, <laughs> even if they are the daughter of the Archduke's concubine. Gustadolf's full siblings are the worst of the lot. Uh, they have not a shred of human compassion between them. They cruelly bully the girl endlessly, regardless of time or place. Is this... True? Of course it is! I know Frederica's suffering all too well. My own father lived ever in the shadow of his elder brother. The former Archduke. Our house, too, is met with sneers by those who consider themselves our betters. But no more! I shall show all no simpering thoughts. It is not birth that makes greatness, but deeds. And so I did my due research at the archives that my grand invention shall blast our way forward. <laughs> Tregan, please. I believe you had enough to drink. <laughs> you can hardly blame me for availing myself of Glenbrook's finest libations, brought by traders from the realm over. Each 
task more exotic than the last. <laughs> Why do not partake would be an affront to our newfound allies. You are drunk. Just make sure your head is clear for tomorrow. Or have you forgotten you're meant to be representing your nation? Mm, oh, yes, a, a ceremony to usher in a new age of harmony and prosperity. I am too young to have known the war, so I, I see our three nations joining hands more as a matter of expedience. Good voice acting on this guy. But what of you, my kin to be? How do you see our grand cooperative adventure? Oh, I got the decision map. There it is. It is the first step towards true harmony among our three nations. I welcome it. It will benefit. It will benefit all nations involved. I see nothing wrong with that. It is impossible to understand each nation's motivations. I can't say whether this bodes well. It's a step forward towards true harmony among our three nations. I welcome it. It is the first step towards true harmony among our three nations. I welcome it. I see. I admire your optimism, even if I cannot say I share it. I know that old grudges die hard. Still, I choose to believe we can overcome our differences. <laughs> Truly, a kind-hearted soul you are. And people are ever eager to follow a kind heart over a wicked one. Mm, yes, I suspect it shall be your strength going forward. Okay, no In any event, it is always good to have another perspective on matters. Let me tell you what I believe. I believe we're on the cusp of a great achievement! As always, it is the young who must bear the burden of building the future. Old soldiers are frail, old minds stubborn. Whatever lies in our future, those who make it will mark their names in history. And mine, mine will be writ large for all to see! And I would write yours next to it, my dear cousin. Pray, come visit me at the mines once operations are underway, and I, I shall... Trigan, are, are you quite, quite alright? Right? Worry not, Frederica. I'm just a bit tipsy. <laughs> Perhaps I should just lie. It would seem Lord Trigan has turned in for the night. <laughs> Quite the passionate fellow, isn't he? He's never been one to hide his ambition, ever since we were little. Neither does he hide his disapproval of my brother and true-born siblings. Feelings which you share? I grant it would be satisfying to see the sneers of those who look down on me wiped from their faces. But I also agree with Lord Simone that we must set our gazes to the future. Though I know not yet how I might best serve in this new age, I would do what I can. We are of the same mind in that regard, my lady. Let us ease the weight of each other's burdens. Please, call me Frederica. We already have husband and wife after all. Of course, my... <laughs> Frederica. Pray call me Sarah Noah as well. Uh, we, we should, should carry your cousin, cousin to his, his chambers. chambers. Will, Will you, you help me, Frederica? Certainly, Sarah Noah. Let us take care not to wake him, lest he resume his prattle. Yeah. 
These two get along very well, I will say. Oh, okay, well, there's one for <sighs> the openings. Benedict! Mm. I, I thought, thought I, I might find, find you here. here. My, My lord. Did, Did you tell her? That Serenoa would soon be taking over as lord of our house. Forgive me, my lord. I did not think to. Save your apologies, Benedict. Doubtless she was overjoyed to hear it from you. Destra always did trust you above all her advisors. As do I. For thirty years you have served my house better than I ever could have asked for. You honor me, my lord. My lord! <laughs> I suspect this will be the last night I will hear those. My lord, I will call for a healer at once. Do not bother, Benedict. It will avail me not. You know as well as I how my heart now fails me. My lord. And so I entrust Serenoa to you. For our house. Pray heed this old man's final order. Certainly, I will live to serve your son until I breathe my last. Did you hear that, Destra? Our boy is in good hands. My old dear friend, long have we stood together. I will not let you down, my lord. Nothing, there's no other things going on. So we have a pretty decent roster here. Everybody's level 2 except for Gila. Because uh, healing doesn't really give you as much XP. Let's see what our new proof prospects here we got. Uh, we got uh, Anna, who's the spy. Iron Dagger, Act Twice. Which I'm wondering if uh, Act Twice is uh, automatic or not. Is passive, okay. So I'm guessing that's automatic. She can also throw poison and take cover later on. And surmount, whatever that means. Two actions per turn, but can only move one. So you have to move her in position and she can make like two attacks, basically. And now we also have Irador. Hey. It already has like an extra ability actually. It has provoke chance to infuriate all enemies within range for two turns. And sprint. And you move it by one for three turns. So he can actually rush into a position and take it. That's actually pretty darn good. Unfortunately, I'm guessing this is one thing that's not level 2, it's level 3. Okay. Haste, so she can haste an ally. There's also Sanctuary, which I'm guessing is probably a big AoE heal. And for those in need, I'm guessing it's the shield. Probably raise defense or regen. Alright, cool. We also got those um, uh, notes we got. We got volumes 8 and 12 here. So, up the Norzelli River and past a handful of craggy mountains lies the Ace Frosty capital. Despite the blizzards off swirling around it, the city itself is orderly and well maintained, and the people who dwell there are spirited and undaunted. Always well, we saw spirited. <laughs> By working together, they have managed to thrive one in one of the most inhospitable places in the realm. It is this fortitude that has allowed Aeus Frost to grow into a nation to be reckoned with. Aeus Frost Ironstone was carved out of a rocky mountainside, which is unusual, but fitting for the land with countless iron mines within 
defense powers. It functions as both a castle and an iron factory. Skilled artisans in the Grand Duchy, or Duchy uh, are brought to the castle, where they uh, mass, pro mass produce iron works and engage in technological research. I'm guessing it's probably guns. Uh, thanks to an enormous forge and large it is hot as it has the mouth of a volcano within the castle. They are able to create huge quantities of ironware and weapons on a daily basis for Eofrost's pride and joy. The Black Irons. Upon the castle's ramparts is arguably the crowning achievement of Eofrosty's iron workings. A gigantic bell. Larger than the largest dragon. I cannot even begin to fathom how they managed to create such a beast. All right, each day, the bell tolls the time for the people of the capital. It is loud. It can be heard all throughout the mountains and, and even been known to trigger avalanches in the distant slopes. In Marvels of Nerzelia Volume 12, there is no sight in the realm as impressive as Hyzanti capital. After braving the vast desert, the first thing a visitor to this great city sees is, is the wall is so huge. It does not look like it could have been made by human hands. The guy is a shield. Pass through the gate and you will merge into a thriving metropolis of believers. Just beyond the street lies the huge calm waters of the source. Unbelievable as it may seem, the city and the wall encircles the entirety of the Great Lake where all of Norzelia's soul originates. The center of the lake towers a mountain-like statue of the goddess, an enduring symbol of the holy state's faith. Indeed, our indeed. After beholding all how uh, Hyzanti could not only survive in the middle of an hospitable desert, but thrive even in unbelievers such as myself, started to think that statue might actually be the goddess incarnate. In the place in the city centers lives a hierophant, who, they say, hears the voice of the goddess of salt herself. I imagine such a voice would be just as majestic and calm as the city she watches. Okay then. Alright, I guess we're moving on. Yeah, I can't even zoom out enough to actually see the actual castles and stuff, so. Alright, right, right. I didn't get napped with it because baby didn't get napped. That's a lot of people. My, My beloved, beloved son, Sarah Noah will, will oversee the matters, matters at our house from this day, day forward. forward. Must be the next day, I assume. I expect you to serve him as dutifully as you served me. Of course, of course Lord Simon. I'm a lord. Our undying loyalty, loyalty to House Wolford. My son, listen well. The Lord's judgment shapes the face of his kin and subjects alike. Responsibility for their well-being now falls on your shoulders. You must lead them well. Yes, Father. Yeah, we do. I shall keep those words close to my heart. To that, that end, I require, I require wise counsel. Together, you possess a wealth of experience. As Lord House Wolfort, it is my duty to consider the best course from every perspective afforded me. I shirk not from this responsibility. At the same time, I would be a fool to not seek guidance from those more traveled than I. For my house and my people, I trust I can rely on you. Well spoken, well spoken, my son. son. I, I dare, dare say you are more, more than ready to receive this. The scales of conviction, a holy relic, 
said to be blessed by the deities of old. It was gifted to our family by the King of Glenbrook. From this day on, I entrust it to you. However, it is of little use without these. Coins. Seven of them. Tokens of conviction, we call them. Give one each to only your most trusted retainers and allies. So this is where the triangle strategy uh, name comes into play. Uh, when I was taking part in the beta and conversing with the developers of this, um, so this is, so you see the skill behind uh, our two characters here is actually in three different directions. Well, this is the triangle and the strategy of strategizing way through the game and talking to the other characters like them, try to sway them to um, make a decision as a group. Uh, the more people you sway to the side you kind of want to go to, the stronger it is, but I think they also said that the more uh, you always have that one or two people like go the opposite direction of you, they might actually leave you or there might be a fight or something. Um, I believe that was part of it, so don't quote me on that, but I think that was actually part of it. They will guide, guide you when, when the path, path is darkest. darkest. Their, Their words will illuminate the pitfalls ahead. Heed well, well the advice of your friends and subjects and choose your steps carefully. Such, such has been, been the way, way of our house, and, and such you must see it always shall be. I, I will, will, Father. Father. So I shall treasure, treasure these gifts, gifts and make, make wise use of them in times of need. need. Very, Very good. good. Now, now do, do your, your duty, duty, my son. son. We, we await your orders, orders my lord. lord. We depart for the capital at once. May this ceremony be but the first of many joyous occasions ahead of us. Okay, I don't have a seventh uh, visor though right now, unless it's going to be the prince. And so, and so the stewardship of House Woolford passes from father to son. Lord Simo Woolford, beloved throughout Glenbrook, and trusts the future to young Serenoa. With the ceremony to mark the beginning of the joint mining venture and a tourney on the horizon, the Woolford set forth to the Crown City. With no heroic deeds yet to his name, the new Lord Woolford sets his eyes on the proving grounds, eager to show his worthiness. Now this is actually uh, a day or two after the fact. So Lord Simon will step down. I suppose the time comes for us all to pass on the torch eventually. What, what wisdom, wisdom has your father, father bestowed, bestowed upon you? Hmm. He has, he has told, told me what, what it means to be lord of the house. Very good. Frank? Sarah Noah of House Wolfort. The crown of Glenbrook now looks to you for loyal service and brotherhood. Yes, yes your, your majesty. majesty. I, shall I shall not disappoint. disappoint. I dare, I dare you, you to say, say that, that again, Thalys. Must, Must you make, make me repeat, repeat myself? myself? I, I am the Prime Minister of Estrost. I and I, I alone am fit to represent our nation. Go, Go push, push your, your papers, papers in the shadows, shadows like, like the minor lordling son you are. You would, would say me! me. Whoa. You, you, who would, would be nothing, nothing if not for your, your high birth. birth. Your, your ineptitude is mocked by noble and commoner alike. Again, you, you forget, forget yourself. As long as somebody still has a hangover. You, you both, both forget, forget yourselves. yourselves. Frederica? If, if you, you must raid each, each other, then do so back home. home. Your, Your bickering, bickering will bring, bring shame upon, upon our nation. nation. Go, Such girl. strong words, sister. Do you, do you think, think you're above us now that you're being wed to mighty house, house Wolfort? Please, Erica. My apologies, but the ceremony will begin soon. 
I asked ask the, the delegates of each nation, nation to make their preparations. And, and you must, must be Sarah Noel Noel Wolford. Wolford. Well, well, I suppose, I suppose we, we should bother, bother the happy couple, couple no longer. Well, well done, done, Frederica. Frederica. I, I see you've inherited, inherited your mother's, mother's wiles. She always, she always did, did have a way with men. Oh! Too bad you also inherited her hair. That sickly pink makes me want to retch. Pray forgive my cousins, Lord Serenoa. And, and forgive, forgive me if, if I was out of line. Wow. Um. There's low blows. That was really low. Um. So what? What Dragon said the, the previous night when he was drunk is like truth serum from How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> um. Yeah, that is, uh, wow. Huh. That is evil, man. Those, Those two. two. They, they were... Phallus and Erica Asfrost. Full brother and sister to Archduke Gustadolf. And my half-siblings. I see. Well, well, I, I hope, hope that we, we can, can all come together, together for the, the sake, sake of, of our grand endeavor. Well, they are completely white-skinned, white-haired, everything, so I'm guessing they were, like, uh, albinos. So, yeah, pink hair is definitely not the uh, thing. No, we have a smithy now, okay? We are definitely going to look into that. Where's the blacksmith? Sorry, I had to do it. Uh, if I as a blacksmith, I have the privilege of looking after everyone's weapons. It's my honor to forge and repair whatever wolf or warriors require. Oh god, repair? So you can break things in this game? Ugh. Okay, so this is another tree of, like, leveling up, it looks like. The smithy. At the smithy, you can upgrade your weapons and unlock weapons abilities. Both for of these services require materials and coin. Oops. Uh, each weapon has three ranks. Re increasing weapons rank unlocks you more powerful abilities for that weapon. You can acquire weapon abilities within the same rank in any order. At a, the, but the latter, uh, but the later a skill is learned, the more materials it will require. Wait. But the later a skill is learned, the more materials it will require. Hmm. Oh, okay, my controller is touchy right now. If one ability is, is connected to another with an arrow icon. Then they must be acquired in order for the arrow to indicate. Okay. Weapon abilities contained within a box marked with ore cannot be activated at the same time. However, once you have acquired either one, both become available and you may switch between the two of them at no cost. Okay, so in other words, I can upgrade to here. And then they have to go down to this way. And this is the ore, so I can have weapon rank 2 upgrade to here, switch between those two functions, and I have the glass ability there, which apparently is a luck increase of that. So we have the long sword, the silver sword, and god knows what, which I'm guessing is Excalibur. So this requires, for instance, one iron and gold which is half my gold depository but since this is our main character we might as well upgrade to that and again we have the same thing with each of these so each one of them requires an iron and gold uh so weapon damage up one increases weapon save by five to deal greater damage okay increases my max hp by 10 well if we have a healer we don't have to worry about that increases physical defense by one well if we have a the uh, intentional so 
But if you have an intentional um, guy to taunt, we don't really need that. Magic defense up one. Yeah. And last but not least, increases luck. So let's increase the damage by one. We need silver for that. We're going to be silver. So let's increase that by one. Yep. So we're going to increase our damage output. And then. And I don't know, the thing is, I'm worried about her getting kidnapped or something right now. So I really don't want to upgrade her at all. Um, Anna seems to be very loyal, and Benedict definitely seems to be loyal. Um, I kind of want to upgrade Benedict. Let's see what Benedict can do here. It's the same thing. Okay, the HP up by 10, defense by strength. Oh, increases strength by defense up one, magic by he gets a cane, a fox cane, and something else, which is made out of the city. Interesting. Okay. So what other materials? But the thing is, we also need money to buy materials as well, which is iron, stone, timber, and fiber. So we don't really. All we have is one more iron available. I'm guessing for like my girl, she's gonna need fiber, I guess, to upgrade. Upgrade. Yep. That's right. Uh, two fiber actually, which we only have one of. So in order to buy the fiber, we need 300 gold to buy the fiber, then we need the additional 500 gold for the actual upgrade of it. So yeah. So the tome of fire, the tome of flames, the tome of. Uh, burning of the whole everything. <laughs> all these slots. This is a uh, three by what is it? Six, six, eighteen characters at least. Wow, pretty crazy. All right. Well, main character did get an upgrade, so that was the important part. So don't have to worry about that now. Right, so let's uh, leave the camp. Uh, leave the camp here now, and then uh, we'll save because we did uh, upgrade some stuff. Because the main character is the main character, we're not going to leave um, this thing. So, uh, yeah. And we have no other places to check, just this one, so let's go. My honored guests, guests, I am pleased, pleased to, to announce, announce that, that operations of the Grand Moselian Mines have, have commenced in earnest. earnest. The Earth, the Earth has yielded, yielded treasures, treasures more, more magnificent than even, than even we had anticipated. May the, the mines endure for many years, years. It's, a it's a symbol of prosperity for all of our nations. Well, well said, with, with Hyacinth, salt, salt, and capital. capital. Estros ingenuity and Glenbrook's raw materials and manpower, our realm's future is bright indeed. It is as a partnership built on three pillars, each bearing equal weight. We owe a debt of gratitude for all who have supported this grand adventure. Triangle. A particular note is Lord Dragan, whose knowledge has allowed us to so swiftly see our labor bear fruit. And House Wolfort. Whose mediation has proved invaluable in forming this accord. May their deeds be forever remembered by history. Let us raise our cups and toast to the health and happiness. Lord Serenoa is smiling from ear to ear. Shame his parents could hear to see this. Do not get too swept away in the moment, Eridor. We have, we have a, a job, job to do here, here and the day, day has, has only begun. begun. Now, now the formalities are done, done with, let, let the festivities begin! Step, Step forward, forward, Sir, Sir Maxwell. Maxwell! So, this, this is, is the one they, they call, call the Dawn Spear! Spear. Glenbrook's fiercest, fiercest warrior. They, they say, say he has never, never known, known to defeat. defeat. I would, I would take, take the measure, measure of this man. man. 
Now that the foundations for peace have been laid, let us be stifled by rigid formality no longer. There is a tourney to be had, after all. A much, a much more, more entertaining, entertaining event than, than my endless speeches. Will any among you prove a match for our Sir Maxwell, the, the champion, champion of our, our previous challenge? I very, very much look forward, forward to finding, finding out. Until, Until then, help, help yourselves, yourselves to our hospitality and our wine. Oh, boy. Eat, drink, drink and be, be merry. merry. It, it shall not be long, long until final, final preparations are complete. Our time is nigh, Sarah Noah. Ah, but I forget myself. Our time is nigh, Lord Wolfort. Congratulations, my friend. Yeah. Thank you. But living up to the title will be no easy task. You'll do your father proud, I'm sure. Unlike some of us. Hmm. <sighs> Have faith in yourself, my friend. You too shall do the future of the kingdom. This is no time for your, this is no time for self pity. The prince's subjects mustn't hear him talk that way. Come, prepare for the tourney. We'll take. Have more faith in yourself, my friend. After all, you too shoulder the future of the kingdom. I wonder. I wonder if Glenbrook will truly flourish thanks to anything I do. Of course it will. It already has. Besides, House Wolfort is at your back. My apologies. And thank you. I shall strive to be worthy of your support. You two are quite the pair, aren't you? See, the thing is about going on here is that I feel like Frederica's gonna get kidnapped. There's gonna be a civil war between the Wolforts and somebody else. In that there's gonna be a civil war inside of the royal family because this prince is gonna be backed with my group. And I have to go after the other prince who is a very big meanie. So, yeah, I think that's what's gonna end up happening here. Fast friends from the day we met. And you are? Apologies for not introducing you sooner. This is Huet of the Kingsguard. I am tasked with keeping his highness safe, though he often seems to resent it. Tis a pleasure to meet you, Lord Wolfort. Ah, Prince Roland has told me much about you. I can see he is in good hands. I shall see that it is so, my lord. Now let us begin our preparations. Today we take the field, and today, today we claim victory. Oh, I get you it too. All right, this is over. Unless I have like uh, a minute, a uh, maximum number of characters. We already know what Roland can do. We don't know. We haven't seen what Hewitt can do. So uh, a melee warrior with rain. Strikes foes two squares in front of him with his spear. His steed grants him exceptional mobility. So I guess he gets a horse also. What's Hewitt? Oh, she's the one with the bow. Okay. Rain rains down foes. Rains down on foes from the back of a hawk. Easily traverses terrain with large elevation changes. The higher the ground, the greater her range. So she's in the back row, like, lobbing shots. Okay, cool. There's my range. So I have my another damage dealer and my ranged. I'd best greet our guests. It would kind of also give me a chance to take a look at the measure of my suit of opponents. Well, let's talk to the wife here. Soon it will be our, your first foray into battle. And Lady Federica and I shall experience the true combat for the first time. Do you have a strategy in mind for the tournament? Oh, okay. 
It may be, it, it may be but a turning, but their fate will bring shame upon us. I intend to do whatever I must to win. No. Our house fights with honor. There shall be no tricks, but we will offer our opponents no quarter. You handled yourselves admirably when the bandits attacked. I expect your magic will be key to our victory. I'll do my best to answer your every expectation. If we can, we shall prove ourselves to be What's up, wifey? The daughter here for bed. I hadn't seen her all day, so I want to say goodnight to her. <laughs> Sleep recovery pallet times two. Oh, that sucks, guy. I bought those other ones. Stories of Minister Rex Sarum's skill have reached even the lips of my servants. I very much look forward to learning the truth of these tales. Oh, Benedict. My lord, before the tourney begins, I would like to ask you a single question. To what end do you believe this contest is being held? It's a chance for our three nations to gather and celebrate. Although the battle may be bloodless, victory is sweet all the same. In times of peace, there are precious few chances to display martial prowess. I mean to remind people of House Bluefoot's legacy. It may appear to be mere entertainment, but reputations are at stake. If we show weakness, then it will be noted by all the times. May, may, may appear to be mere entertainment, but reputations are at stake. If we show weakness, then it will be noted by all the times. Just so, my lord, each nation will show their strength and take the measure of the others in turn. It will be a test of skills as well as metal. I will not treat it lightly. Very good. I shall be the first of many to test a come outcome, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm fighting people. I'm not just going around. Jeez, if you can walk back here, this should be something like that. There's an honor to be allowed to f 
pipe that will fit inside. So that was to put one or two. With you by my side, a friend, I feel like we could take on the entire realm. I do say we may even give a Dawn Spear his first taste of defeat. Straight Cashman. I'm seeing anything's glittering. I found another kitty. Hmm, a nice shooting platform. Oh, you. I definitely want to talk to you if you can. Hello. An astounding the metal shall be on display at the tree, my lord. May it leave an impression on all attendants. Congratulations on your recent appointment as lord. I am sure the entire realm will celebrate the occasion. Lord Simon has ever been, or Simon, has ever been a dear friend to us, pray do not hesitate to come to us when times of need. And what group were you from again? I can't remember. You are the new Lord of House Wilford, yes. I have been, I have seen you from afar. I believe this is the first time I've had the pleasure of speaking with you. Even now, the common folk sing of your house, your house's bravery during the assault I remember. However, I suspect it shan't be long before they sing the house more serious uh, deeds instead. I look forward to seeing you at the turning stone soon. Are you drunk yet? Oh, by her lord, and oh, only by her lord, and ferocity, I doubt she judges in formal competition to be worthy of her enemies. Still, if she lives up to her reputation, yep. <laughs> I'm just doing it because, then she shouldn't have to try to make part of her information. Okay. I really don't want to talk to you, but we're going to have to. Know that. I am sorely in day, but I am sure you know that. I have the honor of being one of the saintly seven. The duties of a young workman are many, but I trust you are more than capable. May this mind bring prosperity to us all. Such a massive endeavor is bound to be fraught with danger. If you or yours ever require medical treatment, pray visit the Ministry of Medicine. We are blessed with the finest medicinal, medicinal Finest medical lines, I'll just say right, in Roselia. But our facilities aren't open to just anyone. Mention my name, however, and every service shall be at your disposal. Source name. If you're feeling sore, go to the medical. Source name. Okay. I'd very much like to see how the game goes before. Oh, hello. As the game progresses, you can uncover information that will unlock additional responses in the future conversations. You may view the knowledge you've amassed thus far by selecting War Chronicle information from the main menu. Cool. Oh, young Lord Wolfhort. Well, thank you for uttering of including me among such esteemed company. Each face I see is more impressive than the last. Even members of the Stately Seven are designed to step foot upon our shoes. Of course, I have had many dealings with Azanti in the past. 
I have taken to understand all are equal in the eyes of their goddess, and even those not of noble birth can achieve prestigious stations. Talk about my girl. I intend to use those opportunities to avail myself of this famed world, and perhaps win the ear of a saint in the process. As my station is decided on their birth, I was not aware as it is goddess was so equitable. I would very much like to use it sometime. What about the holy state of Azul? I joined the tourney with my brother, Archie. Sir Maxwell has trained him since he was little. Roland could barely stand after his part. But he even walks like the dust spear now. I'm so proud of him as he's my brother. Ah, oh, my apologies. Franny is always saying that let my emotions get the better of me. Please, keep my brother safe, will you? Alright, let's talk. With the wedding on the horizon, I imagine time must be precious to resource for you. Your life is on the cusp of great change, my young lord. Still, I pray you remain a faithful friend to my brother. He has his fallibles. But I care for him all the same. Yeah, right. King, you carry your father's legacy on his shoulders. Lord, eager am I to see how it fits you. Sorry, I make sure it's going to come Okay. I've trained the prince since he was sincerely old enough, scarcely old enough to hold the spear. I have great interest in seeing his performance at the tournament. I wish you good luck, but I rather your skill carry you to victory. Who are you? Silvio. Lord Cerno, congratulations on the recent appointment. The news of Lord Seaman's abdication was sudden. To be sure, all but the lords must give all their positions in time. Still, I am certain we having the immense irresponsibility trust upon you at such a young age must be trying indeed if you ever request counsel or simply a sympathetic ear to bend to do not hesitate to call upon house atolawar why is there noah benedict has been looking for you ah but it, it seems you've already spoken Your first tourney as lord of your house, huh? I knew the day would come, but still, brings tears to my brings big tears to my eyes when I see it. Always remember that Benedict and I are to have you back, Lord. Uh, come, come to us for whatever you need. That includes the tourney. You need someone in the dirt, my lord, and your man. I'm your man. Let's go. Let's show them what stuff House Wolfwar is made of. Well, get on. Let's see you. Lindry. There's Renora, I understand the her name is now in your hands. Let me introduce myself as your peer. I am Lordry Folks, Lord of one of Gunbrook's three high houses. This tourney will be your first and best chance to show the skill of the world for its new generation. You have my support. May you find success deserving of a high house. So he is one of the other three houses, and I'm the top house. Uh, I don't reckon one so green can stand against the likes of Dawn's beer, but I've seen stranger things. Mr. A. Today I fight by Maxwell's side. Hmm. <coughs> Must be a little roll for it. I am Patriot. Patriarch. Patriarch of House Consul. By King Ragnar's grace, you were, you were chosen above all others to attend this momentous ceremony. It is an honor, truth. 
all we have we owe to our king. Let us continue to serve him as well as we can. Yeah, there's going to be a civil war. Uh, ladies. I mean, the question is for any frosty I can about the archives. And it's said that within the archives, countless tome lies the answer to any and all questions that have been ever asked. You only need to seek them out. A house of dumbness energy? That's certainly something I'd like to see at my own about archives. Soldiers here are obedient. I give them that. I can't say the same for us Frosties, military. For better or worse, you know, Frosties are of true value of freedom over all of them. Those with the drive to succeed naturally rise to the top. Though your kingdom, lords and ladies, might view us as a rabble or a bump, ambitious upstarts, we aren't beholden to traditions in us Frosties. If you ever have any interest in seeing what true freedom looks like, you're welcome anytime. A country where one is judged by ability and not birth is certainly produce some reform soldiers. I shall visit some And does she have a uh, first? Oh god, these two. Ah, Sarah Noah Wolfhart. How good to see you again so soon. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Thalys Elsfrost at your service. I suppose soon I shall be calling you my hmm, brother-in-law. <laughs> this is quite the castle you have. Full of history and great deeds. I hope that one day fate sees it fit to deliver me one so grand. Huh. Huh. I suppose we haven't formally met yet. I am Elika Asfalt. Yes, Frederica is my sister, although I hardly think of her as such. This country is old and lack of a better word. I'm certain it will fit her sensibilities more perfectly. That's what I'd say to you about that. Alright. Let's go talk to my name in competition right here. Avalora. <laughs> a predictable match with a predictable outcome. All right, well, that's done. You go, you go, girl. All right, well, I think that's everybody. Turn around, we'll begin soon. I gotta sit back. All right, now we gotta get some fighting in this game, probably. About time. Recommended level three. That ain't good. How do you level in this game? Is there a way that we can train or something? I still have enough money for do that work. Wait a minute, there's a cat back there. I thought it was a cat. I guess not. There's enough hawks I can do. I can't level or anything, looks like.
Well, this is interesting. I can't level or anything either, so this sucks. All right. I got all of this information from that, from that, all that discussion. So yeah, it's important to talk in between, uh, in between parts though. Let me see where your branches went. Interesting. All right, now we have uh, eight, eight players now. Unfortunately, my healer is still level one. This kind of sucks. We have a lot of group. We have a big group. We have six, seven, eight people. So if we can deploy all eight, feel good. We'll get one battle here and then we'll call it night now. The combatants have arrived, and the stage has been set. Let us introduce the champions who will fight for the glory of their nations. Fighting for the honor of the Grand Duchy of Esfrost, General Avlora. Fighting for the honor of the Holy State of Hyzant, Minister Exham Marshall. Fighting for the honor of the Kingdom of Glenbrook, House Wolfort. And last but not least, the victor of our previous tourney, Sir Maxwell the Donspear! Hurrah! Hurrah! The Wolfort Lordling is here in his father's stead, I see. Lord Simon's heroics on the battlefield are the stuff of legend. A pity I couldn't match swords with him today. Wow. You will match swords with me. I promise to make it every bit as exhilarating as father would. You have his spirit, if nothing else. Indeed. I look forward to crossing swords with you. The combatants have assembled. Now, let the battles begin! I shall announce our first pairing as chosen by lots. Mr. Exham and Lord Walfort, make ready for combat! Of course, I get the healing holy group. Dang it. This is going to be a long fight if they have a lot of healing. During battle preparation, you can survey the battlefield and place units in in return. In return to you can't uh, Decimate enemy forces, lose all allied forces. Alright. You can change the initial placement of your units before battle begins. Select the unit you wish to move with the A button. Move the square you wish to place the unit. Then press A button once more. The square you've selected already has a unit on it. The units will swap places. Okay, what do we got? We got a, a pikeman, which means they can probably attack two squares because I'm assuming there's a spear. We have dagger people throwing dagger. Huh? These guys have range. Oh, these guys are nasty. amy has got a horse. And he can't be taunted. Oh, these guys look not cool, man. These guys look evil. He's level four? I got my mine's level one. Oh, but they don't have healing. Okay. Alright. I'm worried about this over here, so let's. Alright, uh... 
You heal, you heal. You... You have to, like, bulk up on this side, I think. I guess I have to stay within this battle. This is a very small field to fight in. No one's going first, it looks like. No, I... Who's going first, Anna? Not somebody who really want to be going first. He's going next. You can reach me in the first turn. These guys are further down. He's the last to go. Okay. So maybe I just flip flop this, unfortunately. Not the way I want to do it, but. Damage to the left, defend on the right, and then go from there. I'm going eighth. She's second. No one is fourth. Okay. Feel good about this. I think this is the best setup I can do. Alright. And to keep their stuff the same. Battle begin! Be gentle, my lords! I'm not as strapping as once I was. Yeah, but you still level me by two levels. I expect no quarter from you, Prince Roland, nor from you, Lord Serenoa. Show us the sword play your house is so famous for. Unfortunately, I need to come to me, but those spears really scare me. Two of Hyzant's most famed generals will have no room for mistakes. Then we shall make none. Now, let us show the realm the medal of the new generation. Degeneration. generation X. Okay, no. <laughs> For honor and glory! My turn. To have them go to me, which I don't want to do, but charge. Uh, man, is... the gulf between our skills. Holy. Wow, they're aggressive. Time to take flight! Alright, how much your range looking like? The range is the one shorter than the movement. I'm 
up here that far up, but... I still can't hit him. Maybe right there. That's a lot of hit points. I missed. Forward. Oh, where does he go? Exactly what I didn't want to have happened. I see a path to victory. All for victory. How gracious. I'll take you on. Destroy you. Status changes, okay. Shall we begin? is plain to see. Allow me.
Russians gonna kill my right anyways. This battle is ours. Goodbye. That's one. No. By her grace. I see a path to victory. All for victory. I shall do my best. Oh Lord, how shall I destroy you? I shall do what I can. Show you what I've learned. Okay, well, she can take a couple of people. I will end this. I'll take this. My turn. Worthy of my time. Ha! There's no joy in an easy victory. From where shall we strike? Try my level best. Ugh. 
Let us reverse our fortunes. Shall we begin? Allow me. Thank you. Okay. I fight for peace. Down. I can't do anything. Shoot. Sorry, we can win this. No. Okay. I can still move. I'll take this. I won't lose. Huh. Did you see that? Too slow. I shirk from no danger. You fight admirably, but you will not claim victory so easily. Hmm. Their numbers are few, but they are fierce. Stay focused and drive them back. You are not worthy of my time. It ends here. <clears throat> the situation is grim. Oh, this is too good. Oh, I can't double up that? Can't lift that one too? Should be able to. Maybe it's not if it's not two points away. Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> I've gained new strength. This battle is ours. Was so battle, I suppose. <laughs> Shall we begin? Your wounds are healed. The tides are turning. I fight for peace. Oh, they set up so perfectly. Please uh, heed my call. Uh, we will make our ideals Goddess, reality. I thank you for your blessing this day. A worthy foe is a glorious gift indeed. You find the goddess in odd places, Exam. This trifling tourney will bring Hyzant neither riches nor glory. The goddess works in myriad ways, Minister Sorsley. You would do well to keep your eyes attuned. Time to work. All right. You seem all this is very well. Uh. Hello, uh. me. This will prove useful. This is uh. the end. You've left Come yourself off. open. I asked for no quarter. You did not disappoint. Perhaps one day we can fight as allies. Minister Sorsley, I leave the rest in your capable hands. I won't lose! Brace yourself! Oh. You've left yourself oh. open. From where shall we strike? Ha! 
Wait your turn! <laughs> Leave it to me! <laughs> This battle is ours. This ends now! Together. I shall do what I can. Thank you. Let me show you what I've learned. I will end this. You won't escape. Uh. Could this be? <laughs> That's fine. My turn. In corner now. You don't stand a chance. <clears throat> Too slow. <laughs> For the honor of House Wolfort. Ah, my old wounds flare up again. I can fight no further. Yeah, well, I lost two people. Uh, it's pure. Good battle. I think they'd get the better of us. Huh. I thought the second place group from last year. What do you think happen? Your father taught you well. You wield that great sword with skill beyond your years. Well fought. The day is yours. goes to House Wolfort. Our next bout shall be between General Avnora and Sir Maxwell. May glory go to the victor. Was this one? Stand back. This one is mine. <laughs> Very well. I accept your challenge. Whoever taught you, they taught you well. <sighs> Though something tells me you surpassed your teacher long ago. Your defense is formidable. As is yours. I yield. Victory goes to Sir Maxwell! Uh, my hand. I can't feel it. <laughs> so that was General of Laura. I pray never to meet her on the battlefield. Uh oh. That was not good. There will be no quarter given today, young lord of House Wolfort. I would expect nothing less. Huh? 
Where am I? Oh, uh, to fight him? Uh, ah, you're awake. And none the worse for wear, considering the blow you took from Sir Maxwell. Uh, he was too strong for us in the end. Today, yes. But let us keep at our training. One day, the students will surpass their master. Let us work hard for that day, my friend. Okay. So we can get to a safe... Uh, oh, here's our save point. So that'll take care of it for uh, tonight, everybody. Um, I have... Uh, babies to take care of and all so in the morning plus I gotta keep this foot well rested and all so that'll do it uh, for this uh, episode uh, it was no it was no two hour episode there so uh, yeah or hour and a half really so um, I'm gonna continue to play this game I really like this again this is my jam this tactical fantasy Final Fantasy s kind of games uh, these are this is my personal jam this is what I grew up on. So, yeah, I enjoy playing these. So, that'll do it for tonight. Thank you all very much. And I'll see you in the next uh, video. Right? Take care and have a good day.